Hey guys, good morning. Today's the day. I'm super excited. I'm going to Cosmetic Surgery Institute of Palm Desert and I'm gonna get some Botox. Um, actually, I'm gonna get Dysport, which is, I think it's just a type of Botox. Um, I'm gonna get rid of these and I'm gonna have, I think, just a little bit put out here for these. And I would like to find out if there's anything they can do about this, but I don't think Botox is gonna do that because it relaxes it, and if it's relaxed, it's gonna go this way, not that way. So I am going to put on some makeup and get ready to go, even though I know they're gonna take it off. Um, it's filming, I have to have makeup on. So I'm gonna get my makeup on and get ready to go, and then I will check back in with you guys when I'm on my way. I'm so excited, and if you don't like you know, people that put stuff in their face. Just know it's not permanent. I wish it was permanent, but it's not permanent. And it is hyaluronic acid, so it's something your body produces naturally and will just absorb. Anyway, just know it's not permanent. And the Dysport only lasts like six months, I think. So, you know, it's all temporary. But... I'm excited to get it, so I will check back in when we're on our way there. I'm gonna have, I'm taking my granddaughter, because I'm still in California. I'm taking my granddaughter with me to film, because we're gonna film the whole thing. So it's gonna be a great video. Stay tuned. Okay guys, I am ready to go, and it's just about time to leave. It takes 45 minutes to get there from here. And this is the person that my daughter goes to. Um, they call him Dr. Mo. I can't say his last name, but I will put it in the information box if you want to go to him. But I'm going to be not getting any surgery, so I'll be just going to Adrian. So, I will leave her information. Well, it'll be the place's information. I'm excited. I can't wait. I will check back in when we get there. I'll show you the facility, and then we will start our adventure. This is the place, Cosmetic Surgery Institute of Palm Desert, and we're going to go in and you can see how beautiful the lobby is. Hopefully there's nobody else in here. No. Okay, good. Isn't that pretty? I should probably take these off so I could see. So nice. This is Dysport. It's different than Botox. It's a smaller molecule, so it goes into the muscle more quickly. It's a little stronger. It's also great for women who are doing Botox for a lot of years and they've developed a resistance to it. Um, Dysport now is a nice alternative. Okay. Um, I love Dysport around the eyes because it's a smaller molecule. It really, um, the way it diffuses into the, the muscle, it really treats the crow's feet beautifully and the glabella. Really and that's what we're doing. And that's what we're doing. We're doing this area for those 11s, mm -hmm. and then this area is a smile for me. So it's just gonna soften these lines and then relax. It's still, you're still gonna have the lines on the face how you naturally when they're already etched in, but when you smile, you're not gonna have the really deep folds. Great. Okay? Go for it. So I'm gonna have you hold the ice pack up to the right eye. This kind of helps with the feeling and it also helps with bruising. It constricts those blood vessels. That's good. Right. I have one more pineapple to eat. Okay. <laughs> Go ahead and flip it over. Oh, I want idea. you to use the cold side just for the beginning. It gets pretty cold, so about five to ten seconds. And then we'll move over to the left and we'll inject the right. Go ahead. Okay, now smile for me. Real tight, tight, tight. There it is. And relax. Just my finger. Oh. Just get right into the muscle there. And I like to feather under the eye a little bit, just a little droplet, to get the little lines under the eyes as well. And we're going to go right on the side of the brow. This helps give you a lift. Lift is good. Lift is good. This is getting too cold. Okay, I'm going to just take it off. And then go ahead and ice the right. I will inject the left. Okay. Smile for me, really tight, 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 tight. And so you start right here. You have a pretty strong muscle. Go ahead and relax. And a little feathering. And then right into the brow. Perfect. And 
and this is a real common area because the thin is so the skin is so thin to bruise, but mm -hmm. so far it doesn't look like you'll bruise. And we're just gonna hold some pressure just in case. Okay, we're using all of you. <laughs> I think it's the sparkles. Yeah. They hold in the the coolness. Okay, go ahead and switch back over. Now you just kind of rotate between each eye. Rope's okay. thumb. <laughs> so go ahead and frown for me. Give me a big scowl. So we're going to get these corrugators. Do you see the purple plot? I do, yeah. That's weird, huh? Maybe it's a vein? I, I was getting a new vein and it was like all the way down my Stretching head. I'm like, what? Okay, so I'm just going to shine some light on you. I'm just going to close my eyes. Okay, it's just my finger. Go ahead and give me a big scowl. And relax. And then turn towards me a little bit more. I'm short, so I need all the help I can get. And then we get, I like to go right in here in that levator muscle. And then scowl again. And we want to go right at the tail of this cord. It just feels like little bee stings. Yeah, it doesn't hurt. Perfect. So we used 100 units. And look, it sounds like a lot, but with Disport, it uses three times the amount of units as opposed to Botox. Mm. So it's about the same. If this was Botox, it would be about 33 units. Which makes no difference to me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm going to take that off. That good. It must have been number over here because it was like, that's probably frozen Just, too. <laughs> all right, that's all done. So that should give you a nice lift. Or relax these muscles, lift up the eyebrow, and soften the lines around the eyes. Yay. Looks good. 20 years younger, right? That's what I'm going for. And I can't wait for these to take effect. And these, yeah. I'm so excited. Okay, so that's it for now. Yeah, I'll check back in throughout for two weeks um, so that you can see because that's when it's really like done is in two weeks, so. Okay guys, I know it's super, super close, but that's because we're doing an update for the uh, Disport and Botox. And as you can see, it's do, this is day eight. I was going to tell you that because they said that the Botox, the Disport, doesn't take effect until about seven to ten days. And so this is day eight. And as you can see, it's amazing. All this part is so smooth. I keep leaning wrong. So smooth. Um, I still have a thing here because it doesn't get rid of it. There's no filler to it. Oh, right. oh. Oops, there's no filler to it. It's just relaxing these muscles. So it's only gonna be as good as what it is relaxed. It's not going to take anything out. Although I think it does, but it's not supposed to. It's just supposed to be however your skin looks when it's completely relaxed. And I only got it right here for these 11s. And then I got it right here for these. And so you can still see you know, the crow's feet, but they're not nearly as bad. And when I, they're not nearly as bad when I smile. So I just wanted to update you day eight. I will come back in. Oops, I keep leaning the wrong way because I'm looking at the monitor. And I will come back in at the two week point because I think that's when everything's taking effect on the Botox. But I am loving it. And it's actually, I got Disport, which is a type of Botox. So I'm really happy. And it's supposed to last um, six to eight months, I think. So I'm super excited. Super, super. I love it. Love it. Love it. But I do love how she did it. I love how it's looking. I mean, it looks way better when I put makeup on because I still have, you know, discoloration and stuff. But I'm happy. I'm super happy with it. I don't know. If
So this is what we got at eight at day eight. I'll be back on day 14. Okay guys, it has been not two weeks, but almost three weeks. And I just wanted to come in and give you an update, a final update on my Botox. As you can see, it looks amazing. I am super happy with it. I can't believe what a great difference it makes. I would recommend it to anyone. It doesn't hurt at all. And I just wanted you guys to know where I got it done. I got it done at Cosmetic Surgery Institute of Palm Desert. I will put the information right up here. If you are interested, you can give them a call or check them out on the web. Um, I think they have a Facebook page. I'm not sure if they have an Instagram, but they definitely have a website. So I will put that information in the information box below and they definitely do free consultations and I am just truly amazed. You know how in the thumbnail I said, um, does Botox really help at, at 61 years old? It definitely, definitely helps. I mean, look at right here. I haven't put my nails back on yet. <laughs> and then right here, it looks so much better. So, and this is why I don't wear my hair down because it absolutely drives me crazy. But I did it for you guys today because I wanted to be really pretty for the final thing because I think it's amazing. I really should just brush it, I think. What do you guys think? I tried the curling it and then just putting, you know, running my fingers through it. I don't know. I th kind of think it needs brushing. <laughs> Anyways, and I'm wearing a camo shirt with it. That's pretty glam, huh? <laughs> Okay, so I will leave the information in the information box below. I definitely think it's worth it. If you can afford it, because it wasn't cheap, then I say go for it. But then I've always said that if I could ever afford it, I would get it. And I did, and I'm super happy. Up. I am going back for a touch up on the 12th. So um, I will, if. If I get, I don't know if I'm going to need a touch up. I think it looks amazing. So um, I don't know if they're going to do anything, but if they do, I will record that and I will either put it in a vlog probably, or I don't think it'll be long enough to make a whole video out of it, but you never know. I could start cause I'll be in California. So you know how I love to record when I'm in California. <laughs> So anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe before you leave and hit that little notification bell. So you're notified every time I upload a new video. Follow me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. I love you guys. I appreciate you guys so much. Thank you for watching my videos and I will see you in my next video. Mwah!